Hey guys, so I figured I would do a little update. Um, I'm sure it's pretty similar to like everybody else out there right now <laughs> where you're like trying to balance um, homeschooling your children if you don't already homeschool, work, having your whole family home at the same time all the time and more. So I figured I would just do a little update on how we're doing, um, if anything to look back on in the future. So I'm, I'm a little like, Ugh, at the moment, <laughs> I'm, I'm taking a break. This is my break. My laptop died, so it's it's charging, and I'm like, I I need to jump on the charger. So I'm like, I'm just gonna sit down and do a vlog and chat for a few minutes. Hopefully, reset myself. So YouTube is my therapy, um, and be able to finish my work for the day and then move on to feeding my family. Cause I don't know. Everybody is kind of a fend for yourself this morning. Like if you're hungry, you know where the kitchen is sort of a morning. <laughs> um, the kids both had pretty early Zooms with their classes, which is the coolest thing ever. Um, the Driggs class nearly had me in tears as they were talking about who's lost teeth in the last few weeks. And they sung like this, you lost a tooth song to the class together on Zoom. And it was just the sweetest thing. So listening to listening to that in Deacon's or at Drake's class Zoom was just so cute. And they were all showing each other their animals. And it was really fun. Deacon's on the other hand was <laughs> very like rigid, like who, you know, who took their, their thing off mute. And it was like, so like organized and it was so different, such different experiences and, and so perfect at the same time because, um, like Drake's second grade teacher. I don't know how she does it with the like everybody at once, but like she loved it and I loved it and I loved watching it. And like Deacon's was great because it was perfect for him where it's structured and like very organized. Also huge age differences here. So needless to say, it was really, really cute, really fun to like even just see their classmates and stuff like that. So they had their Zooms and then they both had the reading and the journaling and then to work on their packets from the district, which are very, um, pretty just generic like busy work but it's nice because it's something I am not taking this my I keep getting asked like how's homeschooling going and it's like well <laughs> we're doing more of life skills like yesterday we taught I didn't do this um but Deacon learned how to light the charcoal grill that we have and which we we recently got um so he learned how to do the charcoal grill and he learned how to you know they started the generator for you know upcoming summer stuff we're trying to get like a few things done overall we've been really like not productive I'm very disappointed in fact I created a list like uh when this all started and I'm like oh this is gonna be a great opportunity to get stuff done Guys, I could have normally done this list in like two days and it's been like two weeks and I've gotten a couple of things done. Been not productive at all, but I think a lot of it's just because there's so many more, I mean, there's so many more dishes and there's, there's just so many more people in a small space, like where you're trying to just clean up all day. Oh my gosh, I swear it's so much. Um, I thought, uh, now I'm completely sidetracked, but I thought that like, throughout this like this would be a great opportunity to catch up on everything we could get so much done it's just not happening and I've gotten a few things done but it's like I don't know I think it's just having everybody home so it, this morning the kids had that and we had the school and in between me like kind of sort of doing a like a half-assed job of like playing teacher with them while we get stuff done because I'm trying to work and I've got my clients calling me and like blah <laughs> it's just it's crazy I'm like I'm never gonna get that like I'm never gonna get anything done. And like, just having the four of us at home and like, there was probably about 10 minutes today where I was working, uh, Deacon was on a Zoom, Drake was reading, my boyfriend's working, like everybody's getting their stuff done. And it was just peaceful for a second. It was so nice because it felt like such a productive 10 minutes. But the rest of it, like what? <laughs> Why can't I get a grip on this? Why can't, why can't I be posting YouTube videos every single day? why not? But then also the, the same part of me is like, okay, I'm already always so busy with like my work and my stuff, but now I'm not leaving the house, but, but now I do have the kids home. Like, so it's kind of like, all right, well, this is why I'm not finding all these extra hours because I'm still doing all of my normal stuff. Plus extra. I don't know. I just, I feel so like, oh, and even he, my boyfriend even sent me a screenshot that says like, it's okay to feel, um, uh, something like not accomplished. I'll, I'll, 
I'll put it in the description, whatever that quote was. Um, and he saw it just on Facebook. It's like from like psychology today. And I'm like, okay, well, at least it's not just me who feels like this or who feels like they're not making the, oh, if you're not making the most of it. Um, but then I really like sit back and I'm like, okay, well, where do, where do I expect to have all this extra time from? You know, anyways. <sighs> so that was now. And then I went downstairs and then I was like pulled in five different directions. And I'm like, okay, I'm just going to go upstairs. I'm going to shut the bedroom door. <laughs> like everybody will be fine. <laughs> and I'm going to sit down and I'm going to get my freaking work done for the rest of the day. I've only got like two hours left where I just need to like tunnel vision for like two hours and just relax. So I, I was just feeling frazzled. I'm like, oh, this is a good time to do a video. Like de-stress a little bit, get it all out <laughs> and then get back to work and hopefully be able to work like uninterrupted for a little bit. Yeah. And that means there's definitely the PlayStation is running and you know, there's probably YouTube videos playing somewhere in the house and it's just whatever. whatever. Um, I'm hoping to take like a hike with the kids this afternoon, like just a small, like 30 minute, just like, let's go for a, a walk. So maybe not a hike. Um, and that's the other thing too, where I'm like, oh, this would be so great. Like we get out our snowshoes and we can do this or that, but it's still, it's just finding the time. I swear there's less of it. I don't know how it's possible. <sighs> Anyways, um, I can tell you the few things I have done. Okay. So if you've noticed the West coast, we're on the West coast. We've been getting a lot of seismic activity lately, <laughs> like things I've had to fix things. So I hung up our cricket bats a little while ago and, um, oh, this started, this was a few weeks ago. I'm sitting on the couch and home alone. So this was like a month ago because nobody was here <laughs> and I'm sitting on the couch and I'm working and all of a sudden, like, you know, you feel a little bit, our toilet paper roll holder, like fell off the wall, just like off, just off the wall, like doop, fell off. And I'm sitting there and I'm like, what in the world? Like, that's weird. And then the next day, and this is the day where like a bigger earthquake was reported. I have shelves with like all of the cricket bats on them above the fireplace now. I don't know if I've shown you guys that or, yet or not, but I love it. And um, the day that we had the earthquake, that did just like, um, it was kind of like that earthquake that I recorded when I was doing LuLaRoe. <laughs> I caught it on video. It was kind of like that one, like really just sharp, loud, bam, done, um, at least for me. So anyways, that fell off the wall. So I had to fix a few things <laughs> and obviously reinforce a few things if they're falling off the wall. So um, anyways, hang the bats and fix the shelves. Um, hang the toilet paper thing. We did a few paintings uh, a few weeks ago. So we hung those up. Um, trimming the plants. I did get that done. There was only two that needed to be trimmed. So it was pretty quick. Um, edging the lawns. So like, I love something about, and I've talked about this before, but like a lawn with like a perfect edge is my favorite thing ever. So I edged the lawns. Um, even though it hasn't really grown much, <laughs> it was, it's just, could use a little tidy up and you know, it was nice. So I did that. Um, I did our neighbors too. And then, oh, we re we did rearrange Deacon's room one day, which was really awesome. It took about three hours and his room is so much more open now. I love it. Uh, and then the other thing was to descale the Keurig and to clean the espresso machine. That's all. <laughs> that's all I've accomplished <laughs> outside of just trying to keep the house running. That's it. Uh, the other things on my list are to organize our games, um, clean all the baseboards, clean out the cabinets, dust the ceiling fans, clean out the fridge and the freezer. Um, Oh, clean out the cars. That really does need to happen. To clean the garage and to clean out underneath the kitchen sink, which isn't much, but it's still on the list to do because I want to like, you know, get everything out, wipe it all out and, you know, refold all the towels that are down there, whatever. So we have to be in quarantine now for what, another month? So I'm like, okay, maybe one every three days. <laughs> Like, why can't I just do it all in one day? <laughs> even now I'm like, okay, well I just use this 10 minutes. I even thought like, oh my gosh, I'm going to get to watch TV. Like I'm going to watch so much TV. Uh, I watched, let's see, I have catch up, caught up or kept up with Lego masters because of Drake. Um, we've seen a couple episodes of Forged and Fire now. Last night, Oh, last night we tried to watch Shameless, but then the kids came in. So that was the end of that. I made, I posted a picture on, um, I'm still wearing the same thing I was wearing last night. I have showered in between, but, um, I'm wearing the same thing I wore last night and which are my like Santa pants. And I shared a picture 
I made myself my own little private size, personal size, seven layer bean dip and it was so good. So I had that and folded laundry and then the kids ruined it because it's not kid friendly. Oh, and we watched War of the World. So that's it. That sums up my TV for the last three weeks. Why? Anyways, how are you guys doing? Like, is it the same? Is it the same? Or tell me if like somebody's out there being productive, like I want to hear all about it because I'm so jealous. But working from home is hard and then working from home with kids is extra hard. And I'm sure a lot of people are learning this now. <laughs> the same things I've been complaining about forever where I'm like, yep, I am. I, we I take them to the trampoline park where we have our membership so I can sit and work and they can jump or, um, you know, the water park or just things like where I'm like, they've got Wi-Fi. I can sit and work and they can play. And it's really hard because we can't do that now. So even like my my good old handy like tricks are not working. Um, I'm going to share my meal plan for the week in the next video. And then so tomorrow and then I have another haul video. I lost my pen. And then um, yeah, that'll be it. So we'll see. I'm going to keep working on this list. And hopefully, <laughs> hopefully I finish it. I don't know. Anyways, I'll talk to you guys soon. Thank you. I feel, I do feel a lot better now. <laughs> Bye.